Hurry! Oh, there it is again! There it is again! Mom! Dad! Look! I don't see anything. Uh, well, look better! Ed, there's nothing to see. But there was! Something glorious! What? I definitely, positively, just saw a real, live mermaid! My family are explorers. We have been for generations. While others look up to the stars, we know there are an infinite number of things that shine in the darkness below. There are things lurking in the seas that long ago vanished into myth. My family are the Nectins, and we explore the deep. Okay, Aunt. Describe this so-called mermaid. Oh, she was amazing! Her top half was human. Definitely human. And she had this elegant, shimmering tail. Her hair was long and sort of green. Oh, the way she swam, it was so graceful. She was just... beautiful. <laughs> that was awesome, Professor! He totally bought it. <laughs> Your brother's always been gullible. A believer in all things weird and wonderful. I'm with you on the weird. So promise you won't tell Ant anything? We'll unveil the Mimic Knight when it's ready, not before. I love surprises. This thing is so fast, so agile. Fast is good. Agile is even better. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Activating dolphin mode. <laughs> Check it out. These guys totally accept me. I bet they'd accept anyone in this night. Maybe not me. I talk a lot. <laughs> It'll make researching marine mammal dynamics a breeze. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, it might still need some fine tuning. It's trying to switch me back into default mode. Oh, oh! Something's definitely not right. Not right is my specialty. Uh, I mean, fixing stuff that's not right is my specialty. Let's have a look, see. Oh, there, see? I mean, it's a little blurry, but you get the general idea. Yeah. It does sort of look like one. Oh, wait till I tell Fontaine! Hey, Fontaine! Guess what? You finally realized your fish has the intelligence of an amoeba? <gasps> Don't you listen to her, Jeffrey! I just saw a mermaid! Really, Ant? A mermaid? Yes! We should head out and look for it! Oh, this could be the opportunity of a lifetime! Or I could stay here and read in peace without you. Which would definitely be the opportunity of a lifetime. I saw it, Fontaine, and so did Jeffrey. Well, if a fish says it's true, it must be true. Gotta go, Ant. And that, my friend, is the sound of jealousy talking. Diagnostics show everything's running perfectly. I think I fixed it. Cool. In that case, how about we do some speed tests? But we're miles away from the Aranax. Don't you want to know exactly what the Mimic Knight is capable of? Brace ya! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, um, when you said you fixed this... Accelerate! It's not responding! Oh, I'll try to override you! Could you hurry? It's not working! You'll have to bank up manually! And how do I do that? Deactivate the central processing unit and reverse your current direction! <sighs> Lucky I'm a fan of adrenaline. Hmm. I'm theorizing I didn't fix it after all. <sighs> Good theory. Let's cruise back to the Aranax gently at a moderate speed. Oh, we've got company. <laughs> the Dark Orca! Hello! The bubble. Aye, aye, Captain. Whoa. Well, well, what a pretty little mermaid. Don't touch 
watch the night. I don't take orders from Nectans. We're over to Aranax. SOS! I'm with Fontaine. We need help. Rover, repeat transmission. Come in, Rover. Scramblers. Look, Dad! A mermaid suit! I want it! You can't have it. She can have whatever she wants! Yo, your saintly mother used to call you her little mermaid. She dressed you up as one on your first birthday. Which reminds me of something. This is kidnapping! I am not a lawyer, but I'm almost certain that's illegal. Oh! <laughs> and who are you? Leave Professor Fiction alone. Fiction? You're the one who builds things. The rover's gone, and there's no sign of Fontaine or the professor. Why would they leave without saying something? For a long time, I've had a vision. A vision of a super knight. Oh, for love of... Like the Necton's knights, but bigger, faster, stronger, with weapons and stuff. This... Is my vision. It's not often you see plans drawn in crayon. <sighs> How do you expect to use a flamethrower underwater? You're the genius! Make it work! Firstly, I do not work for pirates. And secondly, this can't be done. It's impossible. Make it possible! There's a... There's a treasure. In the wreckage of a submarine. My useless crew can't dive deep enough, so I'd given up on it. Until now, with a super knight, I can dive deep and tear that tiny axis hole wide apart. <laughs> I want this ready by the time we get to the sub. And don't forget, we've got the Necton precious girl. You wouldn't dare harm her. Accidents can happen on pirate submarines. <sighs> If I build your super knight, you'll let Fontaine go? You have my word. <sighs> I'll need some specialized equipment. Here's your special equipment. Oh, but... oh. The rover's last signal came from here. Maybe they went out to find the mermaid. Doesn't explain why the rover's offline. Unless the mermaid captured them! What? We don't know anything about mermaids. Maybe they collect people. And let's go. We'll cover more territory in the nights. How goes the super night? It's impossible. And considering the materials and the time frame, totally impossible. The only way I could do this in time is if I had help. Fontaine knows. Not going to happen. She knows my methods. I can't do this without Fontaine. Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Huh, how do I put this? No. You know what I like about you? The hard-headedness. Madeline, go elsewhere. <gasps> Did you just give me an order? Yes, little sis. I'll get her out. There are things you shouldn't see. <laughs> I like the sound of that. Your professor is in big trouble. If he can't do this job for my father, well, you can imagine. And his exact words were, I can't do this without Fontaine. Really? Would I lie? You lie all the time. Not this time. I don't want the professor's fate on my conscience. Besides, if you get out of that suit, you'll make me look good in front of my kid sister. It'll take more than that to make you look good. You're really building a knight for Hammerhead? Oh, no. That's impossible. But our safety depends on me trying. <laughs> Bird Madeline! Princess of the Sea! Being a 
mermaid isn't easy. What? Whoa! I can see the mermaid! And? I don't know what you see, but keep your distance. If the mermaid has Fontaine and Professor Fiction, I'm catching her! within the parameters of possibility. Hmm. Retrieve your treasure, huh? Huh? What's that? It looks familiar, huh? <laughs> I'll get the drop on you. Sunken sub, and look, there's Mad Madeline. And still no sign of Fontaine or the Professor. What's your status? Can't talk right now, Dad. I've solved the mystery of the mermaid. Stand by. Shadow Knight camera on. Mom, are you seeing this? Copy, Ant. HUD display transmitting. <laughs> Sitting duck. Your history, Necton. Huh? Whoa! What's happening? I can't stop! Huh? Ah! Ant! Come in, Ant! Will! I think Ant's been attacked by a mermaid. What? En route to Ant's last position. I'm right behind you. Talk about a bad driver. Uh, get that thing away from me! It's not a princess of the sea, it's an uncontrollable death trap! Huh? Wow, cool suit! Does it have weapons and stuff? <laughs> it's got the worst! Responsive too. What on earth is that thing? Gaze upon me, vision made real, Nathan. Gaze upon me, super night. <laughs> what was that for? That uh, just keep you on your toes. Excuse me, was your night designed by a child? How dare you! Uh, put him down. Oh, hey guys. Ha! Make me. Whoa! Uh. Oh. I'll get you your treasure in exchange for our freedom. You expect me to believe that, Nectin? Your knight might do the job, or it might glitch and leave you stranded. <laughs> but my mimic knight can fit through that hole into that sub. I'll get your treasure. I'd be invited to double cross. You've got my brother and Professor Fiction. I'm hardly in a position to double cross you. So, when you had this vision, did you picture it hitting you in the head? Girl, get me treasure! I'm no funny business. Okay, I found the entry point. Good. Go inside and tell me what you see. Okay, here goes. Fontaine? I'm inside. Where to? Down one level. Through the galley. Kiko, I can hear Fontaine and Hammerhead on another channel. 
They must have been taken by the Dark Orca. Okay. This looks like the bridge. There's a desk. Uh, open the third drawer. I've triangulated Fontaine's location. And it's the same as Ant's last known position. Keiko, leave the Aranax. Take a night so we can fly under the radar. On my way. <laughs> What's taking so long? Is it a small green box? <laughs> hey, uh, that's it. Uh, be careful. I, I don't want it damaged. You think we can trust her, Captain? Okay, I'm clear. Now the trade. Ant and Professor Fiction for your treasure. Change of plan. <gasps> the treasure is mine. And your clever professor is mine, too. Hand over the box. Give it up, Hammerhead. Huh? What? Fontaine, what are you doing in that mermaid suit? I'll explain later. So you were double-crossing me after all? No, we have no interest in your treasure. Here, take it. Oh, no. Not again. Ah! <laughs> Take me, traitor! What is going on here? It's not what you think! Traitor! You'll pay for this! Help! Leave, Roar! Huh? I'm trying to deactivate the central processing unit, but it's not working! I can't stop! Get to the bridge now! We need to be in position to assist! It's a disaster out there! Do something! Come on, Professor, think! Hmm. There's gotta be something we can do. Oh, I can't think of anything. Unless... Unless what? Fontaine! Yeah, a little busy here! You need to detach the auto function. Red wires inside the chest panel. Yes. Done. Now what? Now you're in manual mode. to save Hammerhead. Yep. Ah! Uh. Ant, we can use your help! No! Quit taking on my hand! Uh, why is this thing so heavy? Not all of us have access to your lightweight alloys! It's good old-fashioned steel for us pirates! Steel? Are you crazy? I don't know what to do! Look out! Incoming! Relax! You need help, and I think a whirlpool is the answer. Yes! Great idea. Mind if I join you? <laughs> and manual control is beautiful. The Nectans brought him back. Yes! Those no good do gooders. No! <laughs> I fail! I've lost everything! And the enemies have pillaged me treasure! Huh? I believe this is yours. Huh. Nice night. It's sleek, it's agile. But why didn't you tell me about it? And miss out on the chance to make you think you'd seen a real mermaid? No way. How do you suppose Hammerhead knew about the treasure inside that old sub? It was his sub. How do you figure that? It was cheap, badly made, pirate junk everywhere. Besides, the treasure itself was a bit of a giveaway. Dad, what are you doing? I... I have something for you. Mom? 
she made those costumes herself. I thought you should see in case, uh, in case you can't remember. I wanted this to be your best birthday ever. No! Oh, Dad! My birthday is next month. Oh, I knew that. Huh? Very funny. Not falling for that again. How stupid do you think I am, Fontaine? Um, do you really want me to answer that? Why are you asking? Mom! Dad! Confirmed mermaid sighting! Positive ID! It was looking in my window! <laughs> That's awesome! <laughs> Too much fun. Too much fun.